Welcome back to my video blog. I've been in Kosovo this week. I've been meeting the new Prime Minister there and a number of the party leaders. And I must say that in a country that has only been independent for six weeks, we're seeing already uh, some progress. The biggest worry, of course, is that Serbia, and particularly some of the political forces there in the run-up to the Serb general election, is trying to organize insurrection in the northern part of Kosovo, which is mainly populated by Kosovan Serbs. I think we have to be prepared to do everything we can to stop them getting away from with that. Kosovo has to work as a country in which all of its people feel safe and in which the majority Albanian population can be sure that they are safe from the kind of uh, oppression that they've suffered from the Serbs over so many centuries. I think the European Union should be offering Kosovo every support and should be demanding that that country make progress uh, towards a society based on the rule of law and rooting out corruption. Here in uh, Brussels we had a fairly significant event as well. Our Budgetary Control Committee has voted to give discharge to the European Commission uh, on the accounts. Now what this means is we've said that we believe at this time that the European Commission has done enough to force the member states to crack down on misspending of European money. And in particular, the Commission had to give us assurances that it would be prepared to take countries like Germany and Austria uh, to court if they do not provide assurances that European money spent by their government departments in their countries has been properly audited. One of the most important roles of MEPs and MPs in any parliament is making sure that public money is properly spent and I'm glad we've seen some progress on that here this week. If you have any questions about this or about anything else we're doing here, please get in touch either via our website or direct. I'll look forward to reporting back to you again in a week's time.